Stephanie Nicole here and in today's video I'll be showing you how to use the split screen to help you when you're digital planning. Okay so there was a way before Apple came out with the new way of doing it but there was a way that you would do it basically you would use like this bottom right here and you would swipe up and then your dock would show up and anything that was within your dock you were able to um, basically bring over to a split screen so I'll just use <laughs> my zoom one as an example so I could bring that as up as a split screen but now Apple has done it a different way so now they've improved it to where you can take these three dots that, that are at the very top if you look at your iPad and look at the very top you'll see three little gray dots up there so when you tap on those three dots this would come up this will come up you can tap on the one in the middle and the one in the middle will give you a equal split screen now this one right here you're not going to get an equal split screen with that one so let's just tap on this one and what I could do when I'm digital planning is, and I needed to see something from my planner that's on a different page, what I could do is I can do that split screen and bring up another GoodNotes file. And then I can go to my planner and I can continue to write right here. But then I could also look at April. Let's say I wanted to look at the month of April. So I could go back and look at the month of April and then I could see what I did not do or complete in April to write right here. So I could use it that way. I could also um, basically bring up, you know, something I needed to copy from my email or anything. I could bring that up. I could also use this. Oh, sorry. Before I move on. So let's say that I also wanted to do my stickers. I could do that as well. I could use my stickers on one side and then my planner right here. So if I wanted to use a sticker, all I would do is just, let me make sure that's on. Okay. All I would do is just lasso, lasso around the sticker, hold it, and drag it. So I could do it that way. And if I wanted to put my planner on this side and my stickers on this side, I could do that as well. So this time, what I'm going to do is I'm not going to use my pencil, but I'm going to use my finger. I'm going to put my finger on those three dots, and you can see it kind of move when I did it. I'm going to bring this down. I'm going to move it. Bring it over here. So now I have my stickers on this side. And then let's say that I wanted to just have my planner now. So I have two ways of doing this. So what I could do is I can swipe it away by using this bar right here that's in the middle. I can swipe my stickers away like that or if I wanted to keep continue to use them but go full screen, I'm going to move it again. So I'm going to take my finger, take those three dots and I'm going to move it up like that and now it's on top and then I can just swipe it away. And then once I'm ready to use my stickers again, I can just swipe it in and then take my finger again, move it there if I chose, if I choose to. And that is how you do a split screen, guys. Um, if you have any questions, um, just leave them in the comments below. But thank you guys so much for watching this video. And until next time, bye y'all.